welcome to the show. We are here today on Beam NG Drive. This is on the multiplayer mod for Beam. Going to be racing some faux carts. Yes, these are pretend go karts. Uh, vehicles turned into something resembling a go kart. Amy has spent a lot of time building a bunch of these. Actually, got some different ones to check out. We're starting off with a Piccolina uh, that has been stripped out. So these are kind of as stripped out as they can be. They've got sort of CVT gearboxes. So sort of single gear suspension is. Well, non-existent, because uh, it wouldn't be a go-kart. The brakes are very difficult to deal with. Um, but, yeah, this is designed to be some pretend go-karts. And we're starting off at this little uh, go-kart style circuit. It should be interesting. Oh, and the Piccolina is the noisiest thing in existence. And it sounds like it's got to blow and diffuser when you let off the throttle. Because, funnily enough, uh, CVT is a little bit of a, a strange thing on these engines. But there we go. So, we will get ready to go here. Uh, for our first race. It's a five lap race for us here. Oh, I might have jumped the start a little bit. <laughs> Never mind. There is this just din as the Piccolina go-karts launch their sails through the first corners. Amy is out wide. We are going to try and make the most of the opportunity here to get to the inside. Speed Beast has had a half spin. That's all fine. Uh <laughs> So the brakes are very difficult to get the hang of it. It is easy to spin these if you get it wrong. Uh, Longbow is around the outside of everybody and makes up a position there. Lado is leading, though Longbow is going to get really, really hung out to dry there. Uh, we are still clear of Amy. The frame rate's not too bad at the moment. Oh, there goes the uh, absolute racket on the overrun. Longbow ran wide. We'll make that position up. Oh, there has been a crash between a Speed Beast and a Lado. We're going to try and duck underneath Joe. Can't quite do it at this moment in time. I don't think the outside line's going to work there. Can we cut back? for a good exit. Oh, we're trying. We've got the nose alongside. Don't hit back a Spencer. There's a little bit of light contact there. It's fine. My steering's still straight. Uh, <laughs> that's the bit that matters. Lado is leading the way. We're going to go to the outside at turn one. Can't do it. Not got the grip to make that one stick. Uh, oh, big slides. Don't want to be sliding around at all if we can help it. Oh, some contact has been made again. Oh, Lado's gone around from the lead. Lado's binned it from the lead of the race. I don't think he had... I don't think Speedwish is even close enough to have any contact. I think Lado just got it wrong under brakes. And the back end came around. Uh, we have got a car very close behind. This might be some of the closest racing we've had on beam so far. Lado's locked the rears. Lado's gone for a spin in the middle of the corner. I was panicking trying to go wide. I think Lado's been saved by Spencer. Oh, no. No, no. Lado hasn't. Spencer's lost a wheel. I had to say something, didn't I? I just... I had to say something about the racing going well. Uh, <laughs> and it's gone predictably way. It's gone predictably wrong at this point. Uh, they, oh, no. My turn. To, oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, I was trying to boot it and get out of the way, but it wasn't It wasn't very easy. Speed Beast has the lead by a mile. Oh, we are going to go side by side through turn one and then through turn two. Lombo's up to second now. Come on. We can recover this. Uh, maybe. We can still look at maybe a second place. Uh, if we can get it right. Get a good... Get the power down. Get a good exit. Have the... It's such a funny sound. It is. It's like a full-on F1 blow and diffuser going on on the back of it when you lift off. Uh, your Lombo got a little bit twitchy through there. There's a fair bit of understeer uh, going on here. I mean, Speed Beast just has to not make a mistake at this point, and it's kind of in the bag. Uh, we are quick on the way in there. We might have cut the corner a smidge through there. Spencer's very sideways behind us. Don't lock the rears. Uh, that's all. Oh, Speed Beast is out very wide and bouncing that all over the place. Uh, I mean, at least our spin, it was just spin and go. Oh, Speed Beast might have lost some time. Speed may have broken something in that one. Uh, we are uh, not much, not as much time. This is where the way the track curves around. It is really a case of can I catch Longbow here? for that second place. We're quick in some places. Last lap around, Lombo was quick in others. So it's kind of evening itself out at the moment. We're gonna, oh God, bounce a lot over there. Uh, get, like the harder you push, the more you risk having that spin that you really don't want. Uh, you can't be flat through here. Lombo with a massive slide mid corner. I don't want to slide around more than I have to. On the brakes we go. Longbow out wide. We are neater through this section. That's good news for us. Oi! A spit of flames from the back of it. 
Don't lock the rears. Come on, Piccolina. Go, 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 go. It's like Lado and Amy are having a battle further back. It's, <laughs> it's actually really good fun to uh, to race. Oh, Amy's gone round. Uh, Speed Beast has built a gap to us by the looks of it on this one. Yeah, Speed Beast has pulled further away as we are desperately trying to uh, catch up to a Longbow. So, I say it's about the same. We gain, and then we have a slide. Longbow has a slide. I think you don't lose that much time sliding these as you might expect. Uh, so we've got. I mean, this is the final lap of the race now for us. There was a cheat from a Joe, I think. <laughs> I saw Joe go straight on at turn one. <laughs> Joe's out of it. I think Joe's car might be broken, or kind of car, kind of go kart. Uh, uh, that was bad for me. We got lots of understeer mid corner. Uh, we are hoping for a Longbow error. This is where Longbow was wide last time. Is wide again. Are we going to be... So I'm not brave enough under brakes here after my spin. Oh, no! The, okay. Might be a bit too brave. I take that all back. I was incorrect. Uh, uh, someone's throwing a wheel at me. I don't know which one of that was Joe or Amy's wheel that came towards us. Uh, uh, we have gone round. It will be a third place for us. I was pushing it a bit harder than we perhaps needed to by the end. Uh, it was a great race, though. Oh. Oh dear. Things have occurred. That's. Oh, oh no. We've made a ball of Piccolina. <laughs> it's gone wrong. It's all gone really, really wrong. Help! Physics! This isn't supposed to happen. Oh, well done, Speed Beast, for claiming victory. We tried everything to chase down Longbow. We couldn't quite do it in the end. And then physics has occurred. Uh, right. I'm going to reset over there. Things are very broken for me. I'm just going to reload. Oh, dear. <laughs> Things have continued to be broken. Oh, no. We're good. We're fine. <laughs> Somehow we still work. <laughs> it was a great race. Oh, thoroughly enjoyable. I just pushed a little too hard in a couple of places, going for a bit of a spin. But, yeah, it was a lot of fun. For our second race, we have got a bolide. Uh, well, I mean, what's left of a bolide? Pretty much it is <laughs> kind of rather close to a go-kart in the fact that it is just a shell with an engine. Uh, we've also got a Joe as a... We figured out the snowman can stand on the car. It will. The, the snowman will be out of the way by the time we go. Uh, we go racing. We will head to our. Oh God! I jumped the start because I shifted up by accident. Uh, although we didn't actually gain too much, so I just slammed on the brakes. We go for another five lap race in these. These are more difficult to drive than the Piccolina. The brakes aren't too bad. It's the power we've got to watch out for here and the climbing over each other. Uh, basically, the CVT in this is kind of a bit of a bodged job because it's not supposed to have one. Uh, which means what you get is on the power delivery, you are not got much power, not got much power. Holy crap, a lot of power is being dumped out of the rear wheels and I'm going sideways. So... Yeah, that's going to be a fun one, although Speed Beast has just understeered it into a wall there. Uh, there seems to have been a problem on the start line. I'm not quite sure what's happened. Some cars haven't moved, or they might be lagging. I don't know. Uh, there may have been a crap. Oh, no, because Amy and Joe started in reverse for reasons. Because it's a CVT, it can accelerate quite quickly in reverse, funnily enough. Right. Oh, you can see the back end already trying to let go there. Uh, I'm trying to be as delicate as I can with the car. I cannot afford to hit walls that will break or bend a wheel. That is a real concern. Uh, so I've got away with a couple of wall taps and the wheels are still straight. The wheels are still on the car as well, of course. Having these exposed wheels, it is not actually that hard to lose a wheel around here. Uh, there is an Amy, I think, waiting. Probably going to join the back of the pack. Uh, might be a lap down and everything, but can still have a fun race. Oh, we got the back end moving around there. Although that's actually kind of good. We actually got some weight transfer going on there, and it meant we carried some speed. We're trying to put uh, Rusky under pressure here, if we can, through the final corner. Oh, Rusky's having a snap. Now, I lifted big time there because I did not want to get caught up in Rusky's accident, uh, and Rusky has run a little bit wide. We are to the inside now. It is side by side coming down the hill. This corner is notoriously tricky, and you get a lot of oversteer in the cars, and we are going to be up into the lead of the race. Oh, Longbow's had an accident somewhere. Uh, oh, I think I locked the brakes a little bit there. It's, it's dangerous. I say dangerous, no, it's scary driving this car. I know how easy this is to spin. Um, 
I haven't done five laps in a row in practice without pointing the wrong way at some point, so <laughs> I am kind of nervous about this one. We have had a good race up until now. Uh, we will be neat and tight. I mean, I am just currently being ever so careful with the throttle. At the moment, oh, there is a stricken car. Yeah, it is an ever so gingerly with the throttle down here because it would be so easy to get very sideways and... We haven't got a big enough lead that we would get away with a spin. Uh, no, it is not a particularly big lead at all. There's a little lock-up of the brakes. As the brakes are easier to manage on this one. They, they lock up, but they don't qu they're not quite as vicious at uh, trying to give you a murder as uh, some of the other cars that we have around here. Come on, there we go. We have not got a big lead at all uh, in this. We are heading into oh, the final corner. There is a Joe who is so these do because the cbt they can go about as fast in reverse as they can forward um and they have a lot of turning in reverse but they are difficult to steer uh, so joe's trying to do it in reverse oh no and it snapped on me and it has gone and i have stalled and it will not turn on oh no it just let go at an awkward time and that's annoying and then it just didn't want to fire back up again no <laughs> that's oh, damn it final bloody lap of the race Lombo's chassis looks like it's bent, but I don't know whether that's just a little bit of desync, uh, which is quite possible. Oh, god damn it. It's doing so well. It was carrying great speed, but yeah, I just got on the throttle. There's just The power just kicked in, and I wasn't expecting it. And that was that. Uh... Oh. I don't quite know what happened there. That was very weird. Like, I very lightly back bumped the back of Longbow's car and just physics decreed we should stop at that point. Um, so there we go. I believe that is the end of that. <laughs> oh, we survived that hit surprisingly well. We have a flappy front wheel. Um, but other than that, still surprisingly drivable, all things considered. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we went for a spin... We went for a spin at a critical, critical point. I think we ended up third. I think Rusky won. Uh, Lado was second. And I don't quite know what happened with the weird collision with Longbow at that, at that one. That was a little bit odd. Um, yeah. I'm disappointed. <laughs> I'm very disappointed with that one. Such a great race. We had a really good race to chase down and pass the leader. Uh, and then just a tiny bit too much on the throttle is all it took to cause the car all sorts of trouble. And there we go. Can we steal someone else's wheel? Nope. Nope, we've just crash welded ourselves to someone else's car at that point. Um, again, surprisingly still going at the moment. But yeah. Ah, silly error. Silly spin will dump us uh, down the order. We had into our final race with the Widgeon. This was actually the original kind of inspiration for the for the foe cars. This is the closest to a go-kart. Well, like, it's got a little bit more bodywork. It kind of looks a bit like a super kart in some ways. Um, it's much lighter than the other stuff that has gone. So the hope is... It's the easier of all of them to drive. That being said, still the brakes are going to be a concern. Um... It is a six lap race. We're on, still at the motorsport park bit, but we're at a slightly different circuit. Uh, we will see how this will all pan out. I, I don't know. Oh, Longbow locked the wheels in front of me, and Amy's had a crash immediately, and we're going to try to sneak around the outside of everything. It's gone terribly. It has gone absolutely terribly to start with. Who would have thought? <laughs> oh, oh, there's a Lombo having a look. So I'm more focused on trying to get a good exit out of that corner uh, and chase down a Lado. Speed Beast is leading the way here. Lado did actually win that last race. I didn't realise. Uh, Rusky spun and Lado has taken uh, have taken a victory. Oh, come on. Come on, go-kart. Let's not do anything stupid. We get some serious speed down here. Uh, oh. I, had, I locked the brakes and I had to just release the brakes because uh, otherwise we were going to have a spin of our own. And it worked. We got the cart sorted out. Uh, we carry a bit more speed through here than Lado does. Not much, but it is a little bit. I don't know where Longbow is. I daren't look back. 
Longbow is not far behind at all in this one. Speedy's got that little bit of an advantage. Barring a mistake, I think it's going to be difficult to catch. Uh, I'm trying a slightly different line around there. Not working. Lots of understeer. Lots of understeer. Okay, don't go out there. Speed Beast has had an accident. Uh, we are going on the brakes to avoid. Speed Beast's car looks like the remote control car from Toy Story with that colouring. Uh, <laughs> slightly distracted. Um, Longbow is right behind us. This is the battle. I mean, the battle for the lead is really close between us three now. Um, we're coming up to. I think this is. I think we're on lap three. I haven't even paid attention to the lap numbers. Uh, so yeah, I have no idea. Oh, that's out a bit wide again. Lado's gone wider though. Lado's also struggling with the understeer. It's the braking zone down here that's so difficult to get right. We have got it very well that time. I got it very well, but I got it too well. And I think I did the same to Longbow. Like, I, we were about to go straight into the back of Atlanto there. We were just not quite close enough to look for a way past. We bobble over some dirt uh, in all of this. Come on, where can we get a pass? It's going to be at the braking zone into turn kind of one, essentially. Uh, it's going to be the spot. Get a good run out of here and then get the brakes right into turn one. Lado's understeered wide. We've got Longbow right behind us. Uh, oh no, that was all sorts of wrong and Lado's had a crash. We have snuck through and I'm not sure if this is the final lap or if we've got one more. <laughs> what I do know is we're going to be defending from a longbow. There's a green car having a look, but it's got some understeer mid corner. Uh, yeah, we, we were all crossed up under brakes. We were really struggling under braking for that uh, corner and it was... Lado that had the biggest snap. We had a big snap, but uh, it was not too much. I'm just going to be early on the brakes down here. Just don't do anything stupid. I was barely touching the brakes. I haven't got the uh, little bit of the UI on for the pedal, so you can't see. I'm literally using such a little amount of brake pressure because I know how easy these things lock up. We are just being super, super careful. We're going to get a little bit of a slide. Not much, though, through there. Keep it neat and tidy. Speedbeats has recovered quite well from that spin. Uh, it is wide through here. Get a good exit. I believe that is the finish, but I'm not 100% sure, so we will keep going. <laughs> I don't know what lap number we're on. <laughs> we're just, there's, there's a longbow behind us. We're still racing at this point. Uh, we'll just keep going. We'll just keep going indefinitely. I haven't kept track of the number of laps at all. This is the problem. Right? Commentary and... I can commentate and drive. I just can't commentate, drive, and count. That's that's where we draw the line uh, on this one. I mean, we're still having fun with the race against Longbow. And we are across the line again. I think we are done, but we're just having a fun little battle. Oi! It does look like the remote control car from Toy Story. We're just having a fun race with Longbow at the moment. <laughs> can Longbow find a way past? It's tough to overtake around this track, you know, without a mistake. The only place we were going to do it was a dive bomb under brakes. It's really difficult. Uh, Lombo's having a look through that section because it's just, there's not quite enough braking. I, I guess that is go-kart racing for you at the end of the day. Uh, we have forgotten all about the laps and we're just now having fun. Whoa! I, nope. <laughs> I don't think, so. I think Lombo got it. <laughs> oh... Oh dear. It, it, was a great, it was a great race. It was a great race. We will claim a victory in this one. Cel not quite celebratory donuts in this. It was a great race. We were trying to put pressure on Lado. Um, yeah, the braking is always... I mean, you know, it's, it's accurate to a go-kart at the end of the day. Braking can be very, very tricky to, to get right. It is difficult on this game where the brakes are so sensitive. So you're having to use such small amounts on the brake trigger. Um, overtaking was tough around there, but it is good fun. It was really good fun, I have to say. I very much enjoyed these racing these vehicles. They're something different. And this is probably some of the closest racing we've had on Beam, despite them being some of the most difficult cars to drive in some regards. Um, but, uh, yeah, there we go. A very big thank you to uh, Amy for coming up with the idea and building all of these wacky vehicles and coming up with a terrible pun that is Focart as the name for the video. Uh, that <laughs> was all her idea. Uh, but, yeah, these... These were great fun. These were great fun. Um, and I hope you have all enjoyed this video. That, though, is going to be it from me. Thank you all very much for watching. And until next time, uh, goodbye.